guys, Shads here today, bringing you another video. This time it's something a little bit different than usual, uh, gameplay commentary, just to let everyone know what I've got planned for the channel. Um, so I haven't really done a commentary before, so this probably isn't going to be the best I imagine. Hopefully I can get better though as time goes on, um, and what's going to really help me is if you guys can suggest anything I can improve on in the comments, um, and I'm going to be reading them all, and that would help me so much. Um, so the gameplay in the background is a Peacekeeper Nuclear on Hacienda Twilight, uh, one of the ugliest, possibly most eye straining maps in Black Ops 4. I honestly don't know why they made it so dark, um, and it's unfortunate that this was the map that I, managed, that I got a nuclear on. Um, usually I have to whack the brightness up on this map so I can actually see properly, so maybe the settings just didn't translate to the Algata properly, so I'm sorry for that. For those interested on the class setup and the gameplay, I wasn't actually going for a nuclear when I, when I hit it. Uh, I just wanted to continue testing out the Peacekeeper, which I got recently from Supply Crates, and just luckily ended up getting one. Uh, I hit it after the Peacekeeper nerf, which was definitely necessary. Um, I still think it's a very powerful gun if you use it correctly, but not as overpowered as it was before, because it was ridiculous. Um, the class that I used I'll put on the screen now. Um, so I was using stock, quick draw, uh, grip and hybrid mags as the attachments. Um, which I think is the best combination for the Peacekeeper. Maybe grip can be exchanged for something, um, another attachment or another perk maybe. Um, but when you put grip on it just seems to beam people. So that's why I was using it. Um, also looking back on my class I'd probably swap my combat knife. Um, for another perk too, like dexterity or lightweight that I usually use. Um, I honestly don't know why I was using the knife, uh, but it is what it is. Uh, my streaks are also pretty weird because I was going for a Hellstorm challenge at the time, um, where you get uh, have to get a certain number of kills with a Hellstorm, but I usually run UAV, Sniper's Nest, Chopper, uh, or Strike Team. Uh, and if I'm going for Nuclears, uh, just a UAV so I can cycle it quickly so I always know where people are. Um, you'll notice in the gameplay I predominantly play the top floor of the building um, and just as a little tip this is to try and kill people off the spawn or coming up the stairways as much as possible um, it's also a really good way to catch players off guard um, if you're watching the spawn and it's fairly close range so you don't have to deal with any terrible recoil as much um, and of course on this map you can see people easier at the closer range so on to what I've actually got planned for the channel um, so I haven't been sniping a great deal on Black Ops 4, I just don't don't enjoy it that much. Maybe I'd, I'd enjoy it more if I snipe more, um, but that's why I've been a little bit inactive. Um, having said that, I am getting back into the swing of things now. Um, really enjoying reg gunning and league play on this game. Um, sniping is becoming a bit more enjoyable for me, especially uh, with the snipers playlist that they've introduced, which I've been playing uh, this last week. Um, but besides Black Ops 4, I'm also really excited for Modern Warfare. Um, Infinity Ward are my favourite COD developers by a long way. Um, and I'm, I'm the last time they made a boots on the ground, the ground, ground game, I played it for a long time. Um, as you can see from my channel, most of the uploads are ghosts. Um, but on Modern, Modern Warfare, I'm most likely going to be sniping and redgunning throughout the whole, whole game. Um, I'm planning to try and upload every week or every two weeks, um, depending on how busy I am. Um, last time I said this didn't exactly work out, this time I am, time I am a lot more committed, um, and as I said I'm very excited for the next Call of Duty. <coughs> My uploads are going to be dedicated to montages, minitages that I've done in the past, um, and also adding in commentaries and hopefully some live clips and fails once I figure out how to record party chat on the Elgato. Um, also the Modern Warfare beta is out on Xbox on the 19th of September, um, which is a week later than PS4. But regardless, I'm going to be playing that a lot when it drops, and hopefully I can get some gameplays or gameplay and clips uh, during that weekend. And finally, if anyone has any good ideas for uploads that I can do in the future, maybe a 2v2 series that you want to see, um, feel free to leave the ideas in the comments below. And as I said, I'm going to be reading all of them. Uh, so anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you have. Uh, this has been Chads, and I'll see you all in the next video.